back in Washington, dude. I know it's the east side, not the west side, but you're back in Washington. Uh, I'm actually not back in Washington. I'm in, uh, I'm in Logan, Utah. Well, I'm talking about like being back in Washington to race. Oh. Uh, I feel really stupid. Um, it's great, man. My, my family's from Kirkland, uh, so it's a pretty quick, easy travel for them. And uh, it's easy travel from Salt Lake City, too. Um, yeah, this facility is amazing. And, um, I was telling my parents, it's like uh, Indoor Track Town USA. And, uh, uh, yeah, it's an amazing facility. It kind of reminds me of like Ocean Breeze a little bit. But, uh, uh, yeah, it's awesome. We're going to go to the race today. Kind of just talk us through it a little bit. Back and forth, going up to the front, and then eventually finishing third today. Yeah, um, I was feeling pretty good, like, even going into the last lap, I was kind of surprised. I wish I, you know, it was a lot jostling, and I was trying to trying to make the right move. Um, I kind of wish I would have went a little bit earlier, because I was feeling good. But uh, I can't complain, uh, it's my highest, highest finish at the Indoor Championship. For the third place finish, I know it's one spot away, but you can't complain about third place finish champions. How do, you, how do you feel about that? Oh, I'm stoked. I, I have no reason to be upset. Um, I've had a, a really good last five months. A uh, good training block and consistent and staying injury free. And um, Yeah, no, no complaints. I'm, I'm stoked. Uh, we take a little bit of downtime after this. And I kind of started my season back in November, so I'm going to take a few days and chill out and uh, start building up the mileage again. Did you set the pair for 10K in the outdoor season? Yeah, 10K, 5K, uh, probably 10K. Emmanuel, Emmanuel. Emmanuel.